Hello friends, we are going to clean our 3D printer bed. I keep IPA in a quality spray bottle. Cheap dollar store spray bottles are the bane of my existence and I do recommend you get a quality bottle like Zep because quality bottles provide a nice, fine, consistent mist and actually spray when you press the trigger. And here is IPA, which to common folk is isopropyl alcohol. So when you hear us nerds say IPA, it's alcohol. This is 99%. You can use 70%, 80%, 91%, or whatever you get at the Mart of Wall or the Dollar Bush. However, I use 99%. I get them in cases of a dozen from Amazon, and it works well for me. You'll see how nicely this sprays. I use Scott's shop towels. I get these from the Mart of Wall also. They are fantastic because they are strong and they do not shed. I wipe down my bed. I will show you something else I like to use, and that is this, a dollar store sponge. My smooth bed has been wiped down with copious amounts of IPA. You may not be able to tell from here, but it still looks kind of bad. So what I'm gonna do is take this dollar store sponge, saturate it with H2O, water to us lay folk, wipe up all the water I spilled on the floor. That was gross and then I'm gonna wipe down the bed with it. The reason I'm doing this with the sponge and the water instead of IPA is because IPA evaporates very quickly and won't give the materials on the bed, such as your glue stick and hairsprays and God knows whatever else is on it, the time to properly dissolve and absorb into the sponge. So using water, which is slow dissolving and a nice soft sponge, I can slowly let everything on this hotbed absorb the water, dissolve, and then absorb into my cheap dollar store sponge. And because it's a cheap dollar store sponge, when I'm done, I can just throw it away. I then wipe it down one last time with my super awesome Scott's towels. And I don't know if you can tell, but my bed is beautiful.